In today's video, I'm going to be going over a add-on that gives you a concept on what a Minecraft 1.19 and update will look like. The download can be found in the description down below, but without further ado, let's get started in today's awesome add-on showcase. So what you want to do is you want to make a portal like you normally would, and you want to jump in it over here. You will immediately notice that we have a bunch of new structures. We literally have a bunch of new structures over here. And we're going to be taking a look at all of them over here. So bam, here is one structure and I see another one in the distance over there. But uh, all right. So, oh, okay. We get spawners. We get spawners. And inside of this, it contains another shulker box with a enchantment table. And over here, we have more stuff. And we have up here, that will give us access to the roof. And we get a bunch of phantoms for some reason. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And those are basically the same structures over there. But this is another unique structure that I did see over here. And it is basically this massive fossil over here. And this fossil has amethyst in it. Yo, that's cool. So that's how you know that, you know, they do implement the new Minecraft 1.17 features and that this add-on is new. Like, this is not an old one that I showcased. It's actually completely different. It's way more new. And once again, the download can be found in the description down below. But we have amethyst over there. And it's basically like a skeleton of, like, a creature that died or something. So that's honestly pretty cool if you ask me and you'll notice that literally in that endless void we just get a bunch of other structures as well which is just super duper amazing it's basically the same thing like that little spawner thing bajiggy over there but anyways i'm also gonna give you guys a quick how to the game and type it in slash kill at e and then bam there you go it should be good to go and we got the ender dragon down over here but we're gonna get our ender pro ready to go so look it's pretty easy to do it in creative mode so if you want it you know a quick easy way to kill the dragon well that's how you do it and also i'm going to be going through my inventory over here and show you exactly what i have that's new as you can tell we have a bunch of new end stuff over here we have crystals all that void crystals that's what they're called chest plate of void what is this yo this is pretty cool this is pretty cool and um it's gonna be looking up here let's see do we get any new mobs okay we got some new mobs we got some new mobs okay i'm gonna be taking a look at that later but as you can tell, this add-on adds a bunch of, um, you know, Minecraft 1.19 stuff. And let me know in the comment section down below, do you actually think it's going to be, um, you know, an end update? I personally, I'll, I'll reveal it later, but I have a, I think, I like to think I have a good reasoning for it. All right, guys, so here we are in the end city over here. And bam, immediately, we were able to find one of the new and unique biomes over here. So it's, it's completely different from the last one I showcased. It's like completely different like i'm pretty sure you guys could tell it looks amazing though tell me what you guys think we get like these new flowers whoa that's a little bit trippy we get these beautiful purple trees over here with these types of logs and all that so there's honestly so much for us to do over here i love this biome it's amazing it's basically like a uh, an end forest when you really think about it but it goes on for quite a while and it has like a main purple theme to it and i'm pretty sure some of you guys already noticed the structure that was over here which yes we're going to be taking a look at so bam we have like a, a little coliseum no not a coliseum what's it called like the pillar things i don't even know what they're called <laughs> but um here's how it looks like it looks pretty cool we get two little towers up there with a uh, blue fire so I definitely love that but yo it would be so great if the actual end update you know would add stuff like this you know more structures so bam we have some books over here with treasure do you see how insane the treasure is okay so we get these things called void shards and we get void crystal so we're gonna be taking a look at that and you can craft some new uh end update stuff with these crystals by the way so that's honestly gonna be very cool we're gonna be taking a look at that relatively soon and there's some more structures over here. There's way more structures than I actually thought. There was like a little end update house. Yo, why does this look like a like a regular? <laughs> it's kind of trippy. It's kind of trippy. But um, we're gonna. Oh, okay, okay. So here's where the crystal ores are. So you find them in the end, like on the structures. Damn, that makes them rare. Actually, that makes them very rare. Rare. And uh, here's how like the inside looks like. Okay, it's like a library. All right, no, I thought it was like a house, but it's more like a library. All right, I like this. I like this. We get. We get two end portal frames. That's very trippy. Very trippy. And we also get some loot over there. Some of this loot being void shards and elytra and literally enchanted um, diamond stuff. And we get this empty orb. All right. We'll 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 take that. We'll take that. Some diamond stuff. And I really do like that. But there is some even more structures over here. There is another structure literally right next to that over there. So I'm going to be taking a look at this structure over here and see what it has to offer. So it looks pretty cool, but we're going to be going inside over here. So it's basically like a treasure room and I don't think there's a proper entrance. Okay, yo, this structure is very trippy. 
guardians? We got a guardian spawner? What? Okay, but the treasure's gotta be good. Okay, we get some of these, um, and plants, as I like to call them, and potent uh, pollen, which we'll be taking a look at, and some more stuff over here. I'm gonna be taking a look at some of the loot. So you basically get a bunch of flower stuff, essentially, and this is so cool. It's actually so cool. Okay, here is the main entrance, bro. <laughs> I wasn't able to find it, and, um, we have another one of the structures over here, and we also have the big biome that continues on over here, the, the end of the biome that this add-on does introduce. And if you're wondering, yes, it still does maintain the OG um, and the fossil again. Like, literally, we get the big fossil and another fossil. Okay, so there's a bunch of structures, like, pretty close together, and I actually really like that. I don't think it's going to be like that in the actual update, but here is how this next structure looks like. <coughs> pretty cool. We get an ender chest, and we get this cool thingy over here with, like, this big, massive tree. And let's take a look at some of the loot over here. We get some different types of arrows. But yo, this structure looks absolutely amazing. It definitely does give you like some spooky vibes. So right, guys, now here's how the armor looks like over here. So I did equip it and we look super, super duper cool if you ask me. And we do get a bunch of other stuff as well. But actually, let me show you what this actually does give you right now in survival mode. So we're going to be going to survival mode over here. Void hooks O's. We have a void pickaxe and a void war axe, which is 10 damage. Okay. 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 I like this. 8 damage. We have 9 damage. So there's a lot for us to do over here. And this is really cool. This is really cool. And you can craft these uh, shards into little crystals, apparently. Oh, no, no, no. Wait. Yeah, 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 yeah. You could. You could. You could. So... That's pretty cool if you ask me. And next up, we have a Orb of Leaping. Let's take that. Oh, okay. So it, it's like an Ender Pro. It's like an Ender Pro that gives you leaping. Yo, that's really cool. That's actually really unique. I really do like that. So yeah, we literally get a new set of armor that is called uh, the Void Armor. Here's how it is. Crown of the Void, chest plate of the Void, Leggings of the Void, Boots of the Void. That's pretty cool if you ask me. And, you know, this is just super duper amazing. And once again, you're able to craft this using that uh, Void Ore, which is pretty rare to get because you can only normally find that stuff in, of course, um, you know, the structure. So you literally have to travel for so many blocks. So, uh, yeah, it is up to you if you want to get them. But I love this add-on to bits. It's like one of the most polished end updates. We get a new set of armor and so much other cool stuff that I know you guys will love. And uh, we're going to use this one over here. We're going to use it. Let's see. Hey, let's see. Yo, it's actually protecting us really good. I think it's on like hard mode. So the fact that it's doing this well, it's like pretty good, actually, like pretty good. Uh, though it's taking a lot more hits than I expected. Now, this one, this one is good. This one's a, this one's a beast. And uh, I just realized whenever you hold like the heavier weapons, like you get heavier. If that, if that makes any sense, you know, like you feel heavier, you can't jump as high. All right. Bam. We were able to do that out of here. Get out of here. You don't even have to go that far, but okay, let's see. So I just mined it and we get four void shards. All right. That's honestly pretty cool. That's honestly pretty cool. But yeah, there's so many naturally generated structures and so many details. Let me know if you want 1.19 to be the end update or if you want it to be something else. Please like, comment, and subscribe. See you later, French fries.